Okay, this example of benzene chemistry, which is still electrophilic substitution, we're going to have a look at the sulfonation species. First we'll draw it out, which on the CD does actually detail how this is actually made. But this ends up being attacked again by the delocalized rings of benzene. We're going to start off with the Kekulé structure again and draw the involved hydrogen in and as I'm sure you'll remember that this is delta plus because all of these are delta minus. If you imagine oxygen is very electronegative and you haven't just got one of these pulling electrons away you've actually got three so this is really very very plus if you want to think of it like that. So anyway, we draw our arrow attacking this, which then we bounce the charge up to one of the oxygens. That one just happens to be opposite, so it sort of looks good for the electrons to flow in one direction, rather than take a right hand turn up here, left hand turn even. And we move on to draw our intermediate. which will have its positive charge always on the carbon below this hydrogen. Dead easy to remember, but admittedly it does look a little daunting if you're not used to drawing these structures. So we end up with the sulphur, but this time single bond to the oxygen and the minus charge. Now what happens first is this hydrogen then leaves, which creates an H+. Now if we draw, I could draw it out again, but for quickness, we'll assume that this has gone like that, and we're all back to this double bond being there, and that will now attack the hydrogen ion, which will create a Kekulé structure that has been sulfonated and that's like an OH group on the bottom there.